Hey guys, it's Bill, Competition Cars. How you doing this morning? Today we're gonna go over the drive, we're gonna do a driving video on this 1984 C4 Corvette with 6,300 miles. I got Mike the cameraman today. He's filling in for Christian and Anthony. So Mike will just kind of slowly go around the car and the, everybody see the paint and body up in natural light. Then we'll hop in and go for a nice little ride. This is an all original paint car. The paint, paint correct, the ceramic coated for brand new tires. Very minimal wear and tear on this one, guys. Go across that hood so you can see how nice that paint looks. All right, so we'll hop in and go for a little spin. Check all the equipment now. So we got horn works, wipers work. This one on the air. I know the air is nice and cold. Tilt works. Show up there on the head. On the, I'll show the headlights. Headlights up. Headlights down. All the gauges and switches work. The digital dash works perfectly. Driver window down and up. Passenger window down and up. It works great. Power seat on the driver's side works like it should. Passenger mirror, left, right, up and down works. Driver mirror, left, down, up and down works. So everything the car has works. Let's turn on the radio. And the power antenna even works as it should. Now I believe I think this radio has probably been out of this car for a couple of reasons. Sometimes when they take these, uh, well, over time, the Bose stereos, the speakers get crackly and the stereo goes out. So this is crystal clear. There's no crackling in it. And you can see that they may have had a little, uh, they put some pressure on these screws. There's a little little hairline crack here and then one over here, really minimal, which is, but all the rest of the plastic in the car looks pretty good. So I think they probably had this out to, to redo the radio. All right, you ready? ride pan across that hood they can see how nice that paint looks and let's go for a spin get it up to operating temperature and then and then get it uh dusty there Put some wide open throttle pulls check the four plus three transmission we have a crystal clear glass roof no checking or crazing in that which is also unusual normally by now they get crazing and cracking and, and that just speaks to the low mileage and how, how the car was stored. Tilt tele stop, tilt telescopic is all good. This was a big deal when this car came out in 1984. And there was no 83 Corvette and everybody was very excited about about this car made all the news all the uh, car cover magazines and it was just a really big deal now, at the time this was the best vet ever and then over time they came down in value but now in my opinion especially low mile examples this is a four plus three transmission it's got six thousand miles it's a very high option car in very nice condition and um, I think they're starting to come around and command the numbers that they should be commanding especially nice examples such as this one I love the way the, the gear selector feels very notchy if you ever driven gated Ferraris it has that real notchy feel that's kind of what, how this feels Say what you want about the crossfire injection. It is a very smooth accelerating engine. It feels good. I mean, it's, you know, they're not the most highest horsepower cars, but for its time, it did what it was supposed to do. Put Corvette back on the map. And this is a very desirable, collectible car, in my opinion. So now, the four plus three, let me show you how this works. You got, just 
listen to the you can listen to the way the gears change. So it's in second gear right now. You hit this overdrive button, and it gives it, it puts it into a, an overdrive in second. Turn it back off. Do third. You can hear it and feel it. Upshift again. I'll turn that off. Go to fourth. Same thing. So the four plus three performs exactly like it should. At this stoplight, we're going to slow down, do a little quick, full, wide open throttle pull. If you can't tell already that it drives super smooth and very nice. So we're going to catch this light. The brakes feel good, nice and tight, nice and smooth. And this is a car that hasn't just been woken from the dead. It's had a couple of miles put on it recently. Everything is clean and fresh and up to date. So it's a car you can hop it and drive and enjoy. So this light turns green, we'll kind of step on it a little bit. Again, the air conditioning is working beautifully. You can hear there's no hesitation or grinding of the gears. It's just a solid car, guys. So you'll see this video on YouTube first. Any questions, put them in the comment section. Mike, thanks for being my camera guy. I think you're kind of getting the hang of it now. He's done this a few times already. So we appreciate that. And, um, Good luck bidding, guys. Have a great day.